How is everybody doing today? So we are back with some more Red Dead Redemption 2. And um, yeah, this might be the last episode of this game before we end up moving on to the first one. RDR 1. Um, this has been a hell of a ride, guys. It, it's definitely been a hell of a ride. I've had a blast playing this game. Um, today, we're going to focus on cleaning up any side quests we haven't done so far. Um, which I think we've done, but we did most of the side quests as Arthur. Uh, we got a couple bounty hunts that we can do around the, you know, random cities around the map and uh, some hunting and some fishing. So that that's actually what we're going to jump on right in the beginning here. We're going to jump in and try to do some legendary hunts and some legendary fish. Uh, I think the first hunt I want to go after is the alligator or yeah, the legendary alligator thing. Birdie, thank you so much, brother. I appreciate it, man. I love that. Yeah, I, I, I definitely am legendary. Definitely loving it. Yeah, we got Micah's ass. We got his ass. Revenge for Arthur. We got that revenge for Arthur Morgan. We're going to see about that, Cleon. Uh, I haven't run into a legendary animal yet that I couldn't kill in two shots. Um, So to actually have a legendary that puts up a fight, I think is going to be a good time. Like, honestly, like I I'm looking forward to that. Yeah, we, we should go get Micah's guns, right? Because we, uh, we came up here to Arthur's grave. That's uh, where we left off last episode. And uh, Charles did a really good job. He really did. You got this, girl. Okay, so you know what? We're going to set up camp until the morning. Um, we also, I might go poke around and try to find the night folk. Don't know exactly what we have to do in order to make that happen. But we never experienced the night folk um, ever. So I think it'd be pretty cool to go and try and see if we can stir that up. Um, there's a couple of the Easter eggs that we're also going to look for. But we'll, we'll get into it, guys. We'll get into it. Let's sleep until morning. Let me track. So Micah was up here. We'd have to go to like Wallace Station and ride up north from there to get the guns. Let me see something real quick. Broghorn Ranch is pretty close, right? It's close enough. It's closer than where we are now, currently. Two and a half hours left at work? You getting out early today, Bertie? Um, so, Bertie, uh... All in all, man, this game is my now my number one most favorite game of all time. Hands down.
So this is actually saying we're in legendary animal territory. What legendary animals up here? I did the deer already that was up this way. Oh, early finish tonight. Hey, that hey. can't complain, Brady. Can't complain. Uh, but yeah, this is easily probably one of the greatest games ever made. It, it's hard for anything to rival it. Like, just the immersion and... Uh, I've put like 140 hours into this game and it doesn't even... Like, some games, you know what I mean, after a while, like, s some really long games. Because I'm not saying this is the longest game there is, but it, it's it's pretty long. But, you know, generally when you start getting to, like, that 100 hour on a single playthrough of a game, you start being like, oh, man, like, this is kind of dragging out a little bit. You know, this is very, very long. I I bombed, like, almost 140 hours in this game, and I don't even feel like I did it that much. You know, it, it's crazy. Okay, so we're going to head up to Mount Hagen here. Now, the thing is, I don't have any cold weather gear, I don't think. Yeah, we do. Okay, we do. Blow it. Because we're going to need some cold weather gear heading up into these damn mountains. So we're heading up here real quick. We're going to grab Micah's guns. POS. I'm hoping that this legendary alligator is all you guys are cracking it out to be. Like I said, I've done the moose. I've done quite a few of these legendary animals, and I drop them just like any other like regular animal. So I'm hoping this lives up to the hype. Relax now. Ooh. Good thing my horse didn't fucking fuck me right there. That would have been terrible. Now, don't be too sad because even though we're going to beat this game, guys, we will be coming back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Because, as you guys know, we're going to beat RDR 2. We're going to go on. We're going to play Red Dead Redemption 1. And then once we're done with Red Dead Redemption 1, we're going to play Undead Nightmare because I haven't played that ever so i want to check out you know you know me i love zombie games so having a zombie game in a red dead redemption game i don't know to me that's just like the perfect combination so we're gonna do uh, undead nightmare and then once we finish undead nightmare uh, i'll probably check out uh red dead online a little bit just peek around and see what it's all about might not invest too much time into it you know what i mean it's not gonna be something i play all the time but i am interested in checking it out you know what i mean Michael Irish, what's going on? How you doing today? Hell no, Brady. <laughs> That's what's up, dude. Nah, you can't even see up the path here. Yeah, it doesn't need to have any survival, but, uh, you know, just Red Dead and zombies. It's a cool combination. Because there really isn't any survival mechanics in this game either, but it's amazing. So we're headed up. We're getting Micah's guns right now. But John Bon, how you doing today, man? Shannon, I am. Thank you. Thank you so much for the happy Father's Day. How are you doing today, Shannon? <laughs> All right, yeah, there's a shed down there. Hey, Michael, I'm hoping you're enjoying it. Definitely hoping you're enjoying it. there just what this fucking asshole deserves not even a proper burial turn into a goddamn skeleton bro
<laughs> they won't let you disgrace his body. They're like, you already got yours. I tried to shoot him again. I definitely did. It wouldn't let me. <laughs> shoot right next to him. But you can't. They don't let you shoot him again. All types of froze. But we got his ass, guys. We got his ass. Hmm. Molotov? Can you burn him? But then that's doing a favor for his body. Look in the outhouse. That's locked. is that? Is that somebody frozen in there? He's just a permanent part of the, uh, of the, the ground. Oh, you can shoot some of the boards? Let me see. Shouldn't be disturbing this man's grave. There we go. On the back side here, I was able to uh, break a bunch of this. Get a better gun. Yeah, you can break it open in the back there.
Something happened to his leg. Crawled in here and died. Come on, girl. One more time. Okay, so legendary alligator. It's gonna probably be down in this region. Let me check my map. All right, let's check the map. Let's see what we can find. <clears throat> Um, drawings, letters, oops. legendary animals. Okay, so the gator is not on the map. From what I can see. I know he was in the water, though, area. So maybe it'll just tell me when we get there. Yeah, I don't see him on this map. So we'll go to Lagrasse. Yeah, I didn't see the alligator on there. Okay, so we're gonna grab some guns. <clears throat> Probably head out on the water here. So I think this was the town, right? Oh, we got a bounty here. I think this was the little town. Yeah, yeah, we we definitely went out that way. Okay, so if we're gonna be hunting on the legendary alligator, let me go ahead and grab my. We'll bring the Carcano. And my shoddy. Yeah, yeah, this is definitely where we came back from. So he was out there somewhere. We'll take that boat. I remember the mission. This is where that boy got bit. see the the icon on the map to walk down the gators in this This fog isn't doing me any goddamn favors, I'll tell you that.
Uh, oh, the gator's not in the water? Oh, okay, okay. So maybe we'll dock... Cody, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. I'm just waiting for the legendary um, alligator or the legendary animal like tag to pop up. That's what I was waiting for. You guys are trying to say go check over like here. Uh, Top Ice, we are playing Red Dead 1 after this, actually. That is the game plan. There's a lot of gators here. Yeah, we're going to be playing the Red Dead Redemption 1, which is actually takes place after Red Dead Redemption 2. That's why I'm super... Yep, here we go. Entered legendary animal territory. There's too much activity in the area to track the animal. Okay, so this is the this is there the area. Got to eat. <clears throat> All right, so we'll set up camp. Uh, I don't think hunting it in the swamp in the middle of the night is a good idea, but fuck it. I have not done any night folks missions. I don't know how to do the night folk missions. Tater, what's going on? How you doing? Maxi, thank you for the sub.
fucking gator scared the shit out of me, dude. These things are, these ones are huge, man. see any clues. Might have to head back up toward the boat. We'll head back up toward the boat. Wheezy, thank you for the sub. And Michael and Sea Dog, guys, thank you for the subs. That is awesome. <laughs> Holy crap. I really appreciate that. So I haven't seen any clues. Change our clothes really quick to the summer ones. Where the hell's that boat at? So I parked the boat, I think it was like down here somewhere. I can see the boat. <clears throat> the boat's not near anymore. When I camped out, it must have moved it. So do I got to go into the water in order to trick? Because it triggered up here somewhere. It said I was in legendary an animal territory when I was like up this way. Or am I just not in the right area? Should I go on land on this side? By the O in Bayou? Oh, shit!
Horses just abandoned me, guys. Something over here. Okay, so we'll leave this area and we'll come back. Right in the sand in here, sure. We're right in the sand in here. I'll rent a room. And then, uh, <clears throat> we'll go back out, see if that, like, refreshes it or whatnot. Sand and is uh, a lot of the people here don't just like have guns like they do in uh, other parts of Like, if I was in Valentine and bumped into somebody like that, it would have been guns drawn. I think the hotel is down this road, right? Why are you doing this? What's your problem? Yeah, we met up with Tilly already. Yeah, okay. we met. We met up with Tilly. We met up with uh, Mary Beth. Um, so, what did it be? Pearson. You got any rooms? Okay, rooms all set. Just head upstairs when you're ready. I'm told the savages are giving businesses a terrible time up north. Yeah, it's the Hamish side mission. That that's the one we're gonna take care of later on too. So hopefully this refreshes it. We'll go back out in the Make evening. Excuse me. My oh, dude. All right, then. Only during that one mission. Yeah, so I, we seen the legendary alligator in the mission with Arthur and Dutch. We're about to head back. We're about to see if we can get him now. Uh, something did pop up. It did say um, I was in legendary animal territory. But it just said there was too much activity. These days are short. 
Whatever that means. Too much activity. Bounty hunters up there. Gators over here. Who the hell tipped these damn bounty hunter off that I was here? That boy Lamar, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate you. Nothing, guys. I said I got the notification that I was in legendary animal territory earlier. Because of the bounty hunters? Yeah, that makes sense. Should have paid off my fucking bounty. Maybe I, I'm pretty sure it did Don't move. I mean it. You got I'm coming, one last okay? Hands no need for theatrics. Die. You get down now. I mean it. Ah, you got me! This is done! I don't care what the poster says! Kill me! Why would I... Girl. Yeah, so I went to the top of the U over here, guys, and I, I didn't see anything. Uh, hunt the legendary alligator between noon and 6 p.m. Don't know why other times supposedly too much activity. So noon and 6 p.m. It's definitely not right now. Um, it's right off this way. Pump, thank you so much for the 20. I Hunt really the appreciate legendary that. alligator between noon and 6 p.m. Don't know why, but other times are supposedly too much activity. I just got literally wrecked by a damn caravan and then a bounty hunter. Uh, it's, it's so annoying. All right, so we're going to pass till noon. Yeah, this alligator is hard to find, guys. You would think out of all of the animals, it'd be the easiest one to find because uh, it wants to kill us.
We got us. We even got a camouflage on. All right. Yo, are there more bounty hunters, dude? I gotta go pay this bounty off real quick. This shit's gonna frustrate us. It's gonna make everything really hard. Let's go. Um. Rhodes and Sandini are both like practically the same distance away. Yeah, it's fine. We'll go over to Rhodes. That way I don't have to get in the way of those bounty hunters. And we're getting far enough away that uh, it should refresh everything. I only got like a $20 bounty. That's why I don't understand why they're hunting me so hard. When I was playing as Arthur, I never really had the bounty hunters come after me like that. Even when I did hold a bounty. What a lady you are. Kenny, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate it. Let's pay off this bounty. Got some bills to pay, huh? There. Now we don't have nothing to worry about. Farewell. Partner? You did your usual. Good job. All right, so now we'll head back. We're going to go in between the U and the O. Right there. How did I get all this fucking clay on me? I had the regular swamp mud on me, and now I have the... Now I'm full of clay. Yeah, I'm super rich. Yeah, we got a lot of money. We got the Blackwater payout. No, this is, uh, yeah, this was the one that John got at from the farm. It was the, uh, thoroughbred. One man, or a man with no name. That was a rough line right there. We're more ghosts than people talking to him and Sadie. He wasn't lying. We're leaving the mud on though, so we're nice and camouflaged. Gotta have our swamp camo on. Clue right there. It's time, guys. It's about to go down. So, Carcano. Oh. There it is.
What have we here? Still ways off, I reckon. Do you remember, that alligator was this close to the road? Okay, we got our express rounds. No slugs on my shoddy. Gators here, man. Okay, you ain't that far. Is that that motherfucker right there? Yo, that's pretty fucking big. So, from here, I might be able to get, like, two or three shots at him before he can even close the, the gap. But I'm going to try to put one right in his eye, right in his head. I'm not on PS4, no, I'm playing on uh, PC. I thought it was going to be more than that, guys. It's 
motherfucker is big though. Holy shit. Yeah, Ar Arthur did shoot it a bunch. Yeah, it's dead, guys. It's dead. It's bacon. Well, now, now it's going to have a hard time being a legendary alligator without all this skin on it. There's that. We'll run this down to the trapper. What's another what's another legendary animal that we need to hunt? A hard one, guys. Like a, a scary hard one. I did the berry, yeah. I did the beaver, the wolf. We could do the wolf. Legendary cougar. TNA Games, how you doing? We got the legendary moose. Yeah, I nailed that. Pub! Legendary panther is more challenging. Okay, we'll go look for it. Yeah, we'll go try to find a legendary panther. So, buy and selling. All right, let's have a look. Okay, give me a gator pelt. Oh, I'd pay just about any price for this. The legendary panther is more challenging. He's scary. Find him just west of Shady Bell. You okay, girl? Let's go. All right, let me see here. So we're going to bust out our map. We're not far from Shady Bell. Hello, Ryan, thank you for the sub. So what do you mean take out one of the gangs on the map? What does that mean? How, how do I can take down gangs? Like, I know we've had like little run-ins with the gangs and stuff like that, but I know. Okay, let's see. So the panther's not on here either. Oh, it looks like there's a panther all the way over there and uh, like way on the other side of the map. That one looked like it was like way over here. Okay, so legendary wolf. Let me see. Um, this guy said the springs, right? The hell are the springs? They're like right up here somewhere. Here. Let's take out this wolf. Oh, there's a cougar and a panther. Got you, got you. So where is Shady Bell? Shady Bell is over here, right? Yeah, so you said it was what? Uh, Palm, you said it was uh, west of Shady Bell. So like in this area? We'll go to Shady Bell and then we'll just head west. What that? Get 
Oh, you won't be able to get the panther yet? You need to complete Master Hunter Challenge 9? Oof. Okay. Jack, I didn't use Deadeye in that fight against the... I purposely made sure I didn't use Deadeye um, when I fought the Gator because I didn't want to make it easy. Yeah, bro. I, I, what is your problem? Look out! I didn't use Deadeye. I didn't use any target snap or the, you know, where you plant the X's on them and shit. Ah. Or are you talking about the, the panther and the wolf and shit? Yeah, we've done some of the trapper outfits. Yeah, going out and getting them. There's a lot of them, though. Yeah, there's definitely a lot of them. Fight the next animal, knife only. <laughs> yeah. I don't even. Can you even kill the wolf with the knife? Oh, talking about the panther and the wolf. Oh yeah, yeah. I have no plans on using uh, dead eye when it comes to these fights, because yeah, that shit makes it stupid easy. Bad Wolf, we found Gavin again out in the middle of the desert. Am I a master hunter? Um, I don't know. How do I check that? Let's see. Player challenges. John. No, not there. What would it be in progression, maybe? Progress. Challenges. Um, Hunting. Master Hunter. I've only done one of the uh, things, so no. Oh, shit. Yo, some of these challenges are actually really cool. Um, I never really looked into them like that. Like the hunting challenges specifically. Uh, weapons expert. Most challenging weapons in your arsenal. Dynamite, fire bottle, storm. Develop your skills against enemies and wild animals. Like, for instance, for Weapons Expert 2, kill three enemies in 10 seconds only using throwing knives. A hey, rival, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. Um, survivalist. So, yeah. Let's see. At Brian Minard, that's right, you do have to complete the Master Hunter challenges before the legendary panther will spawn. And the panther will kill you. <laughs> well, thank you so much. I really appreciate the super chat. Pla and uh, Plasmatic, thank you for the sub. Yeah, these challenges don't seem too bad. So, what? Collect. I got to collect three perfect quality rab rabbit pelts. Um, I've already got two out of three collected. I don't know. So, maybe, maybe we're not done with. Because that, the, at least the hunting challenges, that sounds like a good time. That sounds like a really good time. Um, okay, I don't need Welcome to go to the family son. Uh. 
Phil, with the four months. Let's shoot some bandits. So, you guys are saying I can hunt down the gangs on the map. Like, well, I well, I already took out, I think we took, we hunted down the Adriscals, right? So, and we hunted down the Lemoyne Raiders. So, wh who, who do we have left? Do we have, we got the, we got the, the dudes there, the Murphy brood. I don't know if we hunted them down. I don't know if we found their little gang how to, I don't know how that works. How to hunt down the other uh, gangs. So we'll head up to Emerald Ranch. That's close to uh, getting closer to the spring. Legendary Cougar. Th that's where we'll go after the wolf. The Skinner Brothers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, how we can hunt those gangs down. Wasn't there a gang in... Um, wasn't there a gang in that fort down south, too? Yeah, I think I seen that fort that we rolled up on. What was it? Fort Mars? Uh, I forgot the name of the fort. We rolled up on a fort and it was full of dudes. And um, I ended up leaving. Okay, Lovejoy Wolf is up here. Okay, so this definitely would be a little bit of a ride. Was it Fort Mercer? I don't know why I keep thinking it was Fort Mer- but Yeah, there was a gang there. Was it Fort Wallace? I, I just knew it was a fort. I don't remember what it was called, though. Is, yo, th so this fort here, Fort Wallace, you see, that's always been red. Is there some, is there a gang in there? I thought that was the army camp. Hey, Small, thank you for the sub. Yeah, I was talking about the fort down in the new region. I forgot what the hell it was called. Thieves landing. We'll, head, we'll, we'll be headed back down south. Because the cougar's down there, and then uh, there's a couple gangs down there we'll take care of. I wanted to figure out how to do the night folk. The night folk sound interesting. If anybody has a surefire way to trigger some night folk stuff. Perm, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Water Marsh at night. Where is Blue Water Marsh? Oh, so that's kind of where we were. There's the army base. 
I'm not gonna mess with that right now, but yeah. Get there before 2 a.m. There's no ghosts in the game, guys. Out of all the things we've seen so far, we've definitely not seen any ghosts. I didn't get the legendary animal trigger. <laughs> Rod's no such thing. I'm not scared. All right, there we go. What's this now? When you make these, a while ago. Get into the marsh. Uh, let me uh, let me grab a, a better gun. We got the vampire. We did get the vampire. I'm not even gonna use a scoped rifle anymore. up to you. Um, Nick, so I put about 140 hours into the game to uh, complete it the first time around. Was that the legendary one? Come on, just thank you for the donut, brother. I appreciate it.
No, I was just surprised. I didn't know that was the legendary one. I, I thought because it just died. So I was like, oh, this must be a regular wolf as it was charging at me. Good girl. Let's go. Yo, can you kill the wolf? Can you kill the animals with the knife? Like, if I were to just, like, knife... How the hell would I do that without just taking stupid amounts of damage, though? Like, I don't mind it being challenging, but just... The wolf would just sit there and rip me up. Okay, so we got the le legendary wolf pelt. Um, we will head down south then to... So Thieves Landing is somewhere you guys are telling me to check out. And from where I seen, it looked like there was a legendary cougar... Pretty far west, so that's like almost all the way far west. Let me see. It was like above the water here. It looked like it was like up here somewhere. Near Gap Tooth Ridge, southwest of uh, Tumbleweed. That's where this water was, so I'm thinking it's probably up in this area. Yeah, and it's Fort Mercer. So we'll hit Thieves Landing. We'll hit Fort Mercer. Bunch of side missions in New Austin? Yeah, that'd be dope. Oh, there was some kind of... Oh, is that that crashed train you guys were telling me? I mean, it doesn't really matter now because... John is so rich, but... Now, are there any legendary stuff? Like, does any of the side content that we're doing here, like the challenges... Does any of this stuff exist in Red Dead Online? Steve's landing up to up here. You actually choose to look like that? Northwest of Lake Longress between 10 p.m. and 5 a.m. to find the night folk. Easy. Legendary fish location. Guys, thank you so much for 200 likes on the stream. I really do appreciate it. So this is considered river, so we'll go special river. Might work. Let's probably fish off that dock over there.
a nice little spot. Milan, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. So the thing about Red Dead Online, guys, is I'm not I'm not in it to like for like the 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 online portion. It, I mean, maybe if I was like if I had like a private server or something like that that I could play on with like other people in like a controlled environment where we didn't have to worry about like all those weirdos that are going around just trolling. Oh, what the hell? Wrong button. I hit E instead of R. Okay. Let's see what's what down there. That was a little obnoxious. Here we go. I ain't scared of no ghosts. I'm just saying there is no ghosts in here in this game, you know what I mean? That little ass fish just fought like that. You're the damn fish. Legendary redfin pickerel. That thing fought for like a minute straight. I thought it was gonna be a pure monster. I mean, it's a big pickerel. <laughs> there, let's go, girl. Um. So I mean, th there's that. You know what I mean? So you guys say that there's ghosts and ghost trains. I haven't seen a ghost. I have not seen a ghost. And I've been all over. I've seen a UFO. No ghost. You guys are just trying to get me to go into some scary places. I mean, I would go try to find the ghost, but the thing is, is John just, he's not, it's not like he's fucking Dean Winchester, you know what I mean? Like, like ghost hunting isn't what John does, you know what I mean? So I can't, I can't bring him out of character to go ghost hunting. It just doesn't, yeah, it's a side mission. It's Hamish's mission that we got to, okay, so where the hell is Thieves Landing? Okay, maybe this place, let's go check this area. Right. I bet all over, half the map's still coming. Ah, I bet all over, dude. There's no ghosts, man. Thank you so much for the donut. I do appreciate it, brother. Yeah, we got the vampire. I, oh, yeah, I did find a vampire. Yeah, this looks like it's time. So we'll go ahead and we'll grab our Carcano, our Pump. Skip! Go on!
shot that kills you. Don't die slow. business. It's a pretty crazy place. So this gang took it over. I never melee. Well, melee in this game is hard because everybody else has fucking guns. <laughs> you know, I literally have to try to close the distance and knife somebody who's uh, shooting at me. And it's just. And it's not like the melee is like all that fleshed out either. I like the. What I like is the melee like gun combos. Like when you're up close and you can like hit somebody and like shoot them. Like that shit's dope as hell. What's that noise? Looks like somebody's taking a piss. Grabbing someone, pinning them to the floor, not tackling, strangling. Oh shit, dude. Yeah, I didn't even know any of that was a thing. It's just hard to pull that stuff off though, Max, when everybody's trying to shoot you, dude. Like, you know what I mean? Trying to close the gap. You just take so much unnecessary damage just trying to get close enough to people to melee them. 
Now, if it was like people prioritize like melee and then pulled guns, but yeah, everybody always, they just pull guns, dude. Oh shit, you can go in this boat. Yeah, there's gold down here. Holy shit. I wonder, can you find gold like that on Red Dead Online too? Let me guess, there's probably some of you guys in chat that are stupid rich on Red Dead Online. Hey, Phil, thank you so much for hanging out today, brother. I really do appreciate it. All right. I got to get in this uh, little compound over here. I wonder if I can hop the gate. Or did I already go back there? Where those four dudes were? Nah, yeah, we haven't been in here. Red Dead Online is all about selling moonshine. There's my girl. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna reveal the rest of this area too. So everything on that side of this is, is Mexico, right? That's what you guys were saying last time. That Mexico DLC for Red Dead 2. That looks like it's on the other side of the water, but you can see that big... Is that on the Mexican side, that that area there? Is that, uh... Is that on our side? There's a little house down here. Oh, it's on the Mexican side. It's huge. Oh, 
lot of fucking rats, dude. Get out! Get out! Fertility statue. How is that? All right, so we cleared out Thieves Landing. Now we'll head down to Fort Mercer. This was more uh, Del Lobos, right? I'm excited to get into Red Dead 1 just to kind of pull it all together. I'm, 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 I'm really looking forward to it. At the end of today, we're going to watch the credits. Um, I know I uh, skipped the credits when we beat the game, but we're going to watch the credits today. Man. Is that... Is that compound there or whatever that what is that dude that is huge is that in red dead one maybe quite a horse maybe in red dead one we'll be able to see what that's all about looks like a fort Legendary animal territory. And what animal might that be? Let's find out. I don't see any clues anywhere. As long as it's not that cougar, I'm all right with it. It's a legendary goat. Might have to take him out. You know how, how you, you guys understand. My relationship with goats.
I'm being stingy as hell with these clues right now. Yeah. That's fine. We'll clear out the fort. Oh, did it say that uh, there was too much activity? I didn't even catch that part. I just seen it said I uh, entered legendary animal territory. Yeah, too much activity. Got it. Yeah, it just popped up again for me. Just gotta go down into the This horse is pretty good, I'm not gonna lie, uh I loved Arthur's horse, but yeah, this one was pretty damn decent. And we got it for free. They just gave it to us when we started uh, at the ranch there. I want to thank you guys for over 260 likes on the stream already. That really means a lot. I know I'm not to mess with these guys. They always try to kill me. So if I go to the stables and shit, I don't have access to any of the horses I had with Arthur, right? Mercer's got a cat. Nice. I haven't, yeah, I haven't checked the, uh, the stables. Some... A Wicked says, some people say Uncle was the protagonist in Red Dead Revolver, One Shot Kid. Now, I do remember, I, the reason why that caught my eyes is because I remember there was a little bit of dialogue with Uncle um, where he was saying that they used to call him One Shot Kid. We should have slept at the bar. Fuck your ass. The feller was hospitable you. enough. We got prices on our heads. We'll make our own on this thing twice. Oh, he has scars and shit. Nah, I don't think it's Uncle. Uncle's he's a goofy guy. I mean, with the amount of detail that Rockstar puts into this game, I'm pretty sure that if it was Uncle, they would have they would have left the scars on his face. Oh, 
<laughs> a lumbago. My horse don't work today, man. This is, we're, we're, we're traveling all over the place. Close. At least I think we're getting close. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Easy now. Uh, not in this playthrough, Mac. Like that that'd be really, really grindy for me to sit there and try to grind out all the outfits. Um I'm not a completionist like at all. Like I never am like a completionist with any games I play. I kind of just do the fun stuff that like the, the the hunting challenges and shit like that interest me a lot. But like trying to get every outfit, it doesn't. You know, I'm not I'm not that kind of like gamer. Now I would get the outfits that I thought looked cool, but because I have the intent on playing uh, Red Dead Redemption One, um, I'm not gonna spend. You know. If I wanted to, if I was only going to play RDR2, I would probably grind out more stuff just because I want to keep playing Red Dead in the Red Dead universe. But um, because I now know I'm going to play Red Dead 1, I don't need to, like, milk this game for everything it has. We will come back to it, though. I'll tell you that much. Okay, so... Shooting the bush?
Yeah, I went from max health to no health. Pretty much instantaneously. Hey, hey, easy. You shoot through the fucking wall, Sway. My man was shooting through the whole wall. Where did I take that shot from?
Zach, how are you doing today, man? Yo, there were some fucking monster Gatlin guns, dude. Yeah, these things, they, they did burr, and I was dead. So this is what I walked into? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, they could have just pinned me down forever with that. That's OP. Two. What are you guys saying? Sneak through the backside, get on the gun, and then kill them all as they come to you? Ah, there we go. Healthcare. Yeah, I could imagine using those machine guns would be pretty damn cool. Now, do any of the gangs from Red Dead Redemption 2 transfer over into RDR1? Like, will I see some of the gangs like Del Lobos or anything like that? Will we see those in Red Dead 1? Or like O'Driscoll's or... Skinner's, like any of them? That's pretty dope. dudes here.
All right, so now that we got that, we're going to head over to the... I think it was over in this area. Was supposed to be the uh, leg legendary panther or whatever. Or legendary cougar. Yeah, I'm definitely going to try to do the night folk. Yeah, for sure. We're going to try to do that. We're going to go hunt this panther. Or cougar or whatever it is. Cutting up through Trump or tumble. I always want to say Trumbull. We'll pass through Tumble. I'll read on our way back. Yeah, I lost the wolf pelt, but it told me I could get it back from the, the trapper or whatever. That's what it said. So, uh, Andy pointed out, I only need one more perfect rabbit pelt for that hunter challenge. So I'll have my vermin rifle just in case we run across a bunny. We could, we could take care of business. But now that I'm looking for a rabbit, we'll never see one. I don't know what level that rabbit was. Doubt it was a perfect, though. Hello, girl.
Yeah, I never thought about that whole thing between like Jack and John not being his uh, his real father. Do you ever actually get to officially find out who Jack's father is, or do they kind of just keep that like? I mean, at the end of the day, his biological father doesn't doesn't matter. You know what I mean? Like, John's taking that up and you know raising him. Obviously, his real father's not there. Uh, what? No, no, it's uh, it's just some root beer. Eric, I confess, I am the father. Pull the fucking gun out. God damn it. Wasn't a clean shot. Had to shoot it twice. It's fucking ruined. Unless the trinket saved it. Yeah. If I had small game arrows, I'd be able to... Get those perfect, no problem. There we go. Legendary animal territory. Now this has to be that damn cougar that we're looking for. So we'll go sniper. I'll probably try to just keep him, hunt him with a shoddy though. There we go. I wonder. Hmm. We got a way to go yet. I can find you. Saying use the bow for the the legendary cougar? Or for the rabbit? Cougar Hughes knife. Guys, you can't kill it with the knife. There's no way that you can kill the cougar with the knife. Go on, girl. Beauty, how you doing today? Is this a fucking sandstorm?
I am Will Game. Thank you so much for the super chat. Go to the legendary cougar. She does not come out until she's 45. You guys are just having me use the knife so it pounces on me and kills me in one hit. There's no, there's, you can't kill it with the knife. There's no way. And then I'm not going to be able to, and then I'm going to have to wait to hunt this thing again. See, he just puts the knife away, dude. Yeah, there's, that's not even fun. That's not even cool. And it's getting eaten. down here. I'm not gonna use Dead Eye though, only because Dead Eye does make it too easy. Look at this sandstorm though, dude. Thank you so much, man. The day Brian transformed into cat food. Happy Father's Day. Raj, thank you so much for the for the dono, bro. I really do appreciate it. Yeah, how the hell do I get this damn cougar to come back? Head in the tumbleweed and then come back over. The problem with using like a, a night, there's no dodge mechanic. You can't dodge out of the way of the cougar. So if you don't kill it before it gets to you it, it's an instant it's gonna jump on you and then you only could I, I think what we got jumped on what tw two or three times before it killed us all the nonsense you don't release me now 12 angry mexicans is gonna ride through this town burn it all to hell only lock me up if you want this town to burn sheriff <laughs> <laughs> we do not respond amicably to threats <clears throat> what's the charge he was robbing a stage then the sentence is death Damn. Make I, your no. peace, partner. The boy was gonna put me in cell. This is wartime, and like you said... No! We can't take the risk. Uh, Sheriff? Okay. From now on, trials are going to be quick, and justice even quicker. We will not submit to these lawless games. 
get this trash out of town. Where there's one Del Lobo, there'll be more. Yes, sir, Sheriff. Now you can be a help or a hindrance. You want to help? Follow me in. Yo, this dude is an absolute oh, savage. Lord. I was hoping you was the obliging kind. I didn't want to be this varietal of sheriff, but the situation demands it. Just take that bounty poster there and you'll find out. These fellas is known as the Del Lobo gang, meaning of the wolf in the Mexican tongue. I only wish they was that civilized. Okay, you got a bounty? I'll take a look at it. $60. So he's wanted alive. So what, the freaking sheriff could shoot him when I bring him back? Joaquin Arroyo. Word is, he's up at Solomon's Folly. These Del Lobos been killing, stealing, torching, and tormenting the good people of this region for too long. Only good one's a dead one. Except if they know a thing or two, and I believe this one does. You bring him here, I'll have a few words, and then I'll send him to St. Peter. You have my sworn oath on that. This bounty. Alive seems a pretty big ask for one of these Del Lobos. It is a pretty big ask, and that's a pretty big price. 60 if bucks, dude. If about justice, he won't be alive for long after you walk him through that door. Hmm. This dude's a savage. You have the authority of this office. Don't be mistaken. That sheriff is definitely a savage. Okay, so we'll head down here. We'll take care of this. You guys said I was a savage. Hey, what's your problem? up on this rock oh. now nah, that that sheriff is way more uh, savage than I am I've never sent people to fucking who do you say whoever the fuck Saint Shadow. Peter is never sent anybody to, to St. Peter just for no reason. <laughs> MZLZ, thank you for the sub. How do I know who is who, though? I can't just go shooting anybody until I find out. Uh, 
Is it the dude with the hat on? Or is it none of those three dudes? It's none of them. We can't kill the kid. Joaquin vouched for him. If Joaquin Arroyo was here, he'd use his own knife on the little squeaker. Oh, oh Dios mío! Dios mío! Dios mío! Hey, one of us. You have a drink of while we kill him, bleed him here. I ain't about to get killed just because you sick and get someone wrong. No, you about to get killed because you don't got cojones. Think about this. Let's think about it. He ain't going nowhere. Joaquin can decide. Joaquin. So kill two of them and then arrest the other, tackle the other one. And uh, hog time and question him, maybe? I'm looking for Joaquin Arroyo. He here? Get the best. Joaquin Arroyo? Joaquin's not here. You want to die, boy? Go back. Where is he? Dios mío, Dios mío. He's up on the tracks! They're roping the train! My bad, dude. Energetic, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate it. Joaquin Arroyo. Arroyo, Arroyo, run! You tell him. Someone wants to have a talk with you. Got him. You, you dumb bastard. Do you know who I am? You'll die for this. You, ah. You're gonna die slow. And you're gonna die hurting. I'm going to watch them do it. And I'm going to laugh. You have a said grab the hat. Was, Royal. I'll grant you that. The problem is the hats, you can't keep them when you pick them up, I don't think. <laughs> I 
<laughs> you so got stupid. this, girl. I'll have every the lobo in nothing come looking for me. We are an army, a legion. You hear those horses? That's those my lady. You'll know your time has come. Okay, well, I'll take that on board. Mr. DLA, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. You know that the lobos? Hey, we killed and we burned all the way across the country. You should be scared. You should be quaking in your boots, Baquero. They'll take your ears, they'll take your nose. There won't be nothing left on your head except bone. Damn, dude. You sure are colorful. I'm going to take the bounty poster. I'm going to shove it down your mouth, and I'm going to burn you alive, mister. You want to burn? You want to scream? That's what's happening to you. You hear me? Are you listening? Deli, thank you for the what sub. I didn't hear you. Why does he keep pulling a gun out? Oh, so I can hit the dude with it if I need to? I don't know why he keeps pulling the gun out over and over. It's mad annoying. Time together is almost at an end. I'm going to see you, but I think he's there. Believe me, there. You guys just see that revolver? I'm a. That, what the fuck is going on, dude? Gun out of your hand. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> I put this hat on and broke the game. Looking for Joaquin Arroyo? I ordered him. Didn't have much hope of seeing him, though. Put him in the cell. You couldn't come get me, Sheriff? <laughs> you yellow belly. You coward. You sent some vaquero. I could have come after you, Arroyo. But it's so damn hot out there, I didn't want to sweat. My friend, they're going to come for you. Then they'll die, too. Now save some breath for my questions, boy. Come on over. I got something. You can count it, or you can trust me. It's all there. Someone's got to do it. I shouldn't think it will be long before another poster goes up there. Come back and check. All right, so we're going to get a room. I think you guys said the, the gun store, right? right here. Also going to see if I can do any customizations of the guns that I have. I ain't seen you around here. Let's have a look. Pretty sure I own every gun in the game. Clean your pistol once a week. Know what I mean? <laughs> All right, then. No trouble. Right, we're going to check out customization. Um, Oh, All yeah, in that well, that are you? Weapon looks good. Okay, so we're going to equip this one and this one.
I think it was the Litchfield was the yeah, this is the new one I got that I You've haven't done anything to yet. Good, I can tell. Um, I got some new stocks that fit this nice. That'll change things. That'll make a difference. Yeah, I never got to put a scope on that one. See you soon. All right, now I got my actual babies on me. Miss these guns. So was it the gun store or the tavern? Where I get the room. Hey there. Get yourself Sir? good and settled. What can I do for it's you? Not here. I didn't see it at the gun store. I'll go check again. I also didn't pay attention at all. You're very kind. We're gonna pass a couple days here in town. Then we'll go back out and uh Well look who's back. Yep, it was him. I'd like a room for the night. All right, hand over. Should be ready. If you can cook it, you ain't gonna find better out there. I'm gonna pass a couple days and then, uh. Yeah, let's see. So we'll go noon. same thing so this should we passed pretty much two days it should be enough time right we'll head back up we should be able to hunt the uh cougar again Alex, so um, we ended up building John's house. His family moved over. We got Micah. Now John is kind of just living his life. He got the Blackwater money, so money really ain't a thing to John. Morning there, partner. Uh, by the by. <laughs> sure. All right, so we're going to go ahead and head back over here. I think the alligator trinket, if I remember correctly when I was playing as Arthur, because that was the one I really wanted. Um, I think that's the one that slows your dead eye drain, right? So I remember there was a trinket that I really wanted, but I couldn't hunt the animal, and I think it was the, uh, because I hadn't progressed far enough in the story, I think it was the alligator one. Have you been to the strange man's house yet? No. What strange man? I've been to plenty of strange houses. Is it in this region? I didn't even realize I didn't have my glasses on. Yep. Uh, 
there's too much activity right now to track the animal. Because we probably have to come back at another time. see Agnes the go we're gonna go hunt down a ghost I still don't believe that there's such a thing in the game but so it's like noon time right now so we'll head back over maybe evening oh, and that should uh yeah, so we'll go back over... You know what? Let's try around noon. See if we can hunt it down now. What about the robot? I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't remember any robots specifically. No, I know we did discover the robot up in that scientist laboratory. What's got into you, girl? Snake over here. Yeah, we went to the lab. Let's see, we should be able to hunt it now, maybe. Yep, awesome. There's a clue down there. Oh, fucker try to get me, dude. Hmm, you're somewhere, but where? Got the original ebony and ivory here, guys. 
But even though this gold gun isn't ever, it's not the true ebony. I'm going the wrong fucking way. We must be near. Get it? I knocked my hat off, dude. We hit him a couple times. You guys don't like the hat? I mean, you guys told me to pick it up. Now you got to live with it. Now you got to live with it. <laughs> this is it. Come on, girl. One more time. Scratch the shit out of our back. That, that's some gnarly scratches right there. So wasn't this an uh, wasn't this Rathskeller fork? Was this a uh, enemy stronghold? No, it wasn't. I don't think it was. I don't remember what that one was. All right, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go up here. We're gonna do Hamish's mission. I want. I want to finish this Hamish's stuff, and then we'll go try to freaking uh, hunt the night people and a ghost. How about that? That that's that's the plan right now. Hamish, night people, ghost. Cannot set up uh, well in a hideout. What does that even mean?
What percent am I at? That's a good question. Um, we are 88% total completion. Well, that's without even trying. Oh, hunting the, the panther palm? Yeah, I couldn't even imagine, dude. Because I got, I got stalked by a panther before, and that shit just kind of jumped out of nowhere. It caught me off guard. Alright, so we're going to head to... What is that? the name of that area up north there? What area would bring me the closest to... What about the reservation? I'm trying to see what would bring me the closest to Hamish. Can't get over how big this map is. Shit's stupid. Annisburg's not too far. The Indian reservation's not too far. Yeah, the the res is pretty good. Res or Annisburg, either or. Yeah, Emerald Ranch is actually right. Yeah, that, that's actually a pretty straight shot. Yeah, we'll go Emerald. That That's good. Pretty much a straight shot right up the road. Got our back still scratched up. Uh, will you go outside the map boundaries and explore more to the north? I didn't know you could leave the map boundaries. Out of mister. Hello, mister. You're new. Hey, Seamus got a mustache now. How can I help you? Think you knew a friend of mine a few years back? A fella called Arthur. Uh permanently increased player stamina. Okay. Yeah, so I can't even do the talisman for Ali. I need uh I need the handcuffs, which uh I was told I need to I think you gotta do a card collection and then you get them sent in the mail and then the other one was a random drop. Lid, thank you for the sub, I appreciate you. After a little tchotchke, you guys, we? thank you so much. All Almost right. four hundred likes on the stream. I really do appreciate that. Right, we're gonna head up here to Hamish's little spot. Yeah, Emerald, Emerald's pretty close to this. We saw that creepy girl standing in the damn window up there. So would this hat be considered a sombrero? Is considered a chat. Is, is. Hey, this is what you guys wanted. This is what chat wanted. All right. As soon as I started going away, I literally seen about a hundred chat messages of people. Go grab the hat. It's unique. It's grab. So now we're wearing it. There it is. Uh, there were so many bad wolf. I can't. 
pretty sure I seen you in there too. There was there was a lot. Poncho needed? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, the moon is nice and bright. Alright, so we're gonna sleep to the morning. Slow now. Because Hamish's missions don't go live until the morning. Till the AM. That hat is completely necessary. Like, oh, you know what? What the, we need an Arthur to have this hat. That that's that's the travesty. That Arthur never got the chance to wear this hat. MC, see, I've tried that. I've tried to do the double tap on. Oh, Christ, it's raining. I've tried to do the double tap on like the West, weapon holsters, right? To get like the weapons to spin, but he doesn't do it. Just put some shits away. Oh, you did it right there. You see that? Well, all I did was that. But then I seen this dude on YouTube. I don't know how the fuck he was doing it, but he was like walking around, like flipping his guns and spinning them. And I'm like, yo, how the hell does he do that? I don't, I checked the keybinds. I, I don't have that. So I don't know how he was doing that. That shit's way beyond me. You think Hamish is gonna like our hat? Hamish! John! He looks so surprised. Come on in! The gun so, spinning is online only? Oh, okay, here. well, that makes. Ah, that's probably why fine, I can't you. figure out how to do it. It's all right then, is it? Living out here, away from civilization? <laughs> civilization? Yeah, I saw what civilization and industrial advancement will get you in the war. Progress, well. It ain't always progress. Besides, I ain't lonely up here. I got company. Yeah, I guess. Come look at these. Arthur caught that. Huh, did he? I know you ain't forgot about him. Oh, I still see him in my dreams. Yeah, I got the whole of nature up here. And I'm gonna make the most of it, as long as there still is some. Whoa. That fucking hat is ridiculous, dude. You weren't lying. <laughs> What's this? Right there by the outhouse. Look at the Holy size of that shit! Boar. Holy hell! I saw some cattle gourd the other day, but I didn't think it was possible. Let's go take care of it. Okay. We need a tank to take that down. Damn! I thought I got him. Pursue! I'll grab the mounts. Up there. Oh, yeah. Got a 
Blood like cast iron! Shit! I, mean, I didn't get him bleeding at all. I got the horses. Come on. Chad, I need my freaking. Afraid I lost sight of him. Don't worry. Trap. Let's go this way. Come on. You see that thing? It's as big as a buffalo. And fast too. Yeah. But I had my Lancaster on me, but I didn't... Yeah, but we'll get him. He came through here, all right. Big shit. He's been across Yo, here twice. Well, yeah, back when I was 16, man, I, I illegally worked in a slaughterhouse. Um, and... Uh, my job was, I didn't, I, I had a super simple job, guys. I used to stand in this little shoot thing and I would have a clipboard that had all the like numbers of like the cows or whatever was being delivered. And they would put their cows would like walk into like this mechanical thing that would like lift up their neck and the rabbi would cut them or they would like hit them with this like little pin thing. But my job was I would literally just go up and look at the ear, read the tag, look for the number and mark it off saying that that cow was pretty much here. Um, so I had the easiest job in the world. And um, I remember after they did all the cows, they do all the special orders. And there was this fucking boar that came in. And oh my God, it was so big. Uh, Cause they had like this little 20, it was like a, it was like almost looked like a, like a drill kind of thing, but it had like a little piston on the bottom of it. And they like push it up against the head and they like hit it and it shoots like a little 22 caliber bullet into the pig's head. And that's how they kill all of the, pigs um and th i swear they shot this thing like fucking five six times nothing they ended up having to use the thing that they kill the cows with to just to, to kill it because it was it was huge it was absolutely huge well he's been up this hill to the right and down this one in front of us but I dan the man thank you for the sub i appreciate it let's split up but you yeah they, they can get monstrous in real life okay good luck to you sir Come on, view. <laughs> that story was boring. <laughs> Damn. Did the boar kill the, the wolf, dude? The wolf tried to, uh. Gorn wolves, too. The wolf tried to eat the wrong pig. Oh, that's Damn it. Seamus. You okay, girl? Let's go. Hamish! Shit! He's after him! Dude, the boar's chasing Hamish! Let's go, let's go. Jesus, no. God. Oh. You all right, old man? Yeah, Hamish. You all right, bud? <laughs> I got thrown and a bastard hog got me. <sighs> Take a bill for me, would you? He's a good horse. He may be stubborn, <clears throat> but he's strong.
Hey, Mish. I have four, dude. Good pig. Shit. Ah. We got him, old man. Look at them laying together. Is that how that was supposed to be? Yeah, it was a boar that killed the king in uh in Game of Thrones. The the big dude, right? Yeah, in the beginning. Yeah, yeah, it was I think yeah, I'm pretty sure it was a boar. So are they supposed to land and lay with each other like that? Poor Hamish, dude. That that's sad, man. You know what? Just for all the love and respect, we'll ditch the sombrero. Now we'll rock Hamish's hat. All right. Come on, mule. Let's go. Oh, this horse is actually kind of fast, dude. Uh, we'll start feeding. Him. Well done. Huh. Hungry? What kind of horse is this? A Dutch warm blood. Says so it's just a regular horse, too. It's not even like it's a racing. Is there a stable around here anywhere? I think the closest stable is what? Saint Denis? Oh, Van Horn has a stable? Let me see here. I always forget about Van Horn. Where's the stable, though? I don't see a stable there. Oh, right here, right here to the north. No, I went to the wrong place. <laughs> Uh, Mick, I'm I'm on PC. I'm playing with mouse and uh, mouse and keyboard. I just lost the damn horse because I hit the freaking fast travel button. We lost Buell. Yeah, I tried canceling it, but I had uh I had already hit the button. But it's all good, guys. Can't bring him with me. Yeah, I didn't bond enough with him. Um, hey, your horse looks like Buell, buddy. Good girl. Let's go. It's, all, it's like it never happened, guys. We get, we got Buell back. What kind of horse is this? Oh, it's a Morgan. Like an Arthur Morgan. 
That man had a wife and 47 children. <laughs> Okay, so now we're going to go ghost hunting, and um, we're going to go ghost hunting and night folk hunting. So you guys said to head over here to Blue Water Marsh, and this is where I can find a ghost, right? Let's see about this ghost BS. All right, game in waiting one. What's going on, brother? How you doing? Oh no, I, I meant to. Why the hell did that happen? I don't. I literally set it up so I could head down to Largris. Um, you call him Dap. <laughs> We'll see about this ghost business, guys. I don't think there's a ghost. You think you guys are just trying to scare me? Because you guys try to say that that uh, woman in black that we've seen um, in the cemetery was a ghost. It's almost nighttime. We'll head up here to Blue Water Marsh. Right off the road right there. Yep. Macro gamer, think hey, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. Head up. Help me! Someone help me! Please help me! What? Ah! What? You won't believe it. I got bitten again. Oh my god, dude. No. I'm already dying. <sighs> Fuck, I'll suck on your leg, dude. It's real deep. Uh, suck it out of me. Please. Can't believe I'm doing this. <laughs> Hold still. Never again, fella. Be smart from now on. Oh, I owe you so much, mister. I can't believe you saved my life twice. Me neither. Well, I best be getting back to town. I wanna eat up. Stiff one tonight. Marat, thank you for the sub. You got this. That's it, fella. You get bit again, you deserve what's coming. You just gave him a stiff one. <laughs> oh, Mr. Bad, that's a good one. Let's get you, what is this house up here? Really quick? Let's get what this building is.
take some rest now. What time is it? Nine o'clock. Is there a specific time that I should wait before looking for the ghost? Or is this a good time? What the fuck is that? Oh, it's a turtle. Thought it was like something like on the ground, like crawling. I was like, oh, that's kind of. Kind of creep. <laughs> After midnight. Let's go search this house first while we're waiting. Fuck, dude. I don't want to know why that fire rug just scared the shit out. I thought somebody was laying on the ground. Another house with a man sitting outside. Just where is it? Got a light over here. Let's go see what that is. Well, it has to be foggy weather or it won't spawn. Well, it's still pretty early. You know, it's one o'clock now. really just fucking run oh there's a goddamn alligator right there
I, mean, I don't think the ghost is gonna spawn because it's not foggy. Where where's the in lack lacke? Where's that in lackey? Lacke. Oh, down here. We're also on the lookout here for night folk. A little bit of fog. Zach, how you doing, brother? Yeah, we did, Scorpion. Nightfold mission is the curve under Blue Marsh, right around there at night till you find a guy camping on the side of the road. So like this curve right here. Like this. Yeah, that's where we just were for the for the ghost too. Whoa now. to me. The fuck is wrong with their eyes? 
That is... That's the night folk. That shit was real creepy. I ain't even gonna lie. KDC, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate it. So there was a cabin over here, right? Oh, is this one down here? Little house. Hello there, mister. Howdy, partner. Hello. Stuck in the trees, dude. <laughs> Not a night folk, is he? You must be real lonely out here, friend. <laughs> Why are you talking all weird, bro? Mister? So, you hungry, huh? I got food. I got food inside. Come along. What kind of setup is this shit, guys? I'll kill the fuck out what this you dude. What you thinking, partner? Now come here. If he takes my fucking money, dude. Don't you hate old Sonny now? If, if he takes my money, Don't dude. What? Oh, you struggle. And you lost, but it was quite a tussle, I tell you. Quite a tussle, my pet. <laughs> See? Friendship ain't so tough. And neither is you. Yo, did he do what I think he did? Yo, why is John walking like that? Did he really just do what I think he did, guys? No, 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 no. Like, did he just, he just took it?
again. Shit! Stay away from me! What are you doing? I hate you! Get lost! Oh, Lord, no! All right, let's go. I don't want you near... Stay away from me! You don't got any objections. What's in here? Why you is want this it this Let's go, girl. I wonder if we could ride those boats out there. Like, you, you guys remember how we seen, uh, are there any, like, uh, Motorized boats that you can use? <laughs> You're okay. You're okay. I seen that boat out there, and I remember in the in the earlier game, we seen like the steamboats. You can't like use the steamboats or anything. Okay, so let me see. Um, you can actually drive the steamboats? Yeah, because I, I, I seen it earlier, but I, I didn't know if we could actually drive them or not. Oh, yeah, John. Yeah, John don't like the water, does he? All right, so this is the curve that we're going to mess around here on, trying to find the mission for the night folk and also try to find that guy camping, right? Well, we went to the pig farm. Yeah, we already, we got screwed over there. But they just, I don't even know what they did. They just robbed us. 
That guy couldn't just leave it at robbing us. Need to get some new, some more food too. Probably hunt some of these damn gators. Real easy hunting. Andrew with the super chat. You delivered that man to St. Peter with extreme <laughs> I was not nah, that that was messed up, man. I wasn't messing around with that. Can't just take it. Oh, yo, there's the mission. There's the mission. But Andrew, thank you so much for the super chat. Yeah, this is a full-blown stranger quest. Maybe I needed to meet them first, because that was the first time I've ever seen them. The commotion. You a loon or something? This night folk country. Night folk? I can handle myself. <laughs> okay. Maybe you should clear out though if you're so troubled by things in the night. It's night folk. And I would, it's just they on my property. Hey, w would you help me uh, get them off? I, I pay you for your troubles. Pay me, huh? Maybe. Show me where this place is. We'll see. All right. Let's go. It's just over there. You good man, partner. <laughs> Them night folk could put me on a pipe. They got their paws on me. Hang me up on a hardwood hammock. Boy, I'm lucky I ain't dead as it is. Night folk. Oh, they bad people. Bad folk. Animals. A lot of them. You know, I ain't never heard no night folk speak. There's not been one peep out of no night folk. Not that I ain't heard it, at least. Imagine not uttering a sound. Can you fathom that? Mm -mm. What kind of evil don't make no sound? Obviously not you. It's bad, all right. Bad. I mean, I don't meet many folk out here on my own, the most part. But I still speak, you know? I talk to myself. Ain't no one else around. Chew my own goddamn ear off. I can imagine. Now, used to be the gators was the worst thing in the bayou. Gators and snakes. I've been snake bit more times I like to remember. Ain't been gator bit, though. Got that to be thankful for, at least. Gator bites is nasty. Mm. Then turtle bites is bad, too. They call them snapping for a reason. I've been known to snap, too. So how about we keep it down? Y yes, partner. Yep. Uh-huh. That's probably best. Hey! Damn bats. Don't you worry about no bats. 
I'll tell you when you got to worry, all right. Damn, this would be like perfect fucking ghost time, wouldn't it? What time is it? Look at that. He fresh. You see what I mean? This night folk work. I knew this feller. Good feller. Didn't deserve this. Now come on. on a tree been here for years you think it's bad being a dead fella on a tree it's worse when you're a live one with a stick through you lamps out they might not speak but they sure can see now look out here there's gators Whoa. What a place to make your home. It's nice, ain't it? up to all sorts. You go deal with them. I'll be here with my rat gun. Okay. Do what you can. Oh, they got someone. Mm, poor fella. Oh, too late for him. That's bad juju, all right. Give me one sec, guys. I'm fixing it right now. Property. All right. We should be good. Uh, yeah, li literally, as soon as I, like, grabbed the dude and shot him, my, my, my PC was like... <laughs> <laughs> I would restart, but I don't want to. I don't want to restart the mission. I'm like, yo, let me, let me, just let me finish this, dude. Just let me finish this. 
Come get your reward. <clears throat> I'm just trying to grab the reward, guys, so I can save the game. Don't don't worry about me frozen in the corner there. I can't I can't have my first night folk mission be all jacked up, so we're just gonna restart it. It is what it is. It is what it is. No, nah, this ain't pre recorded, Danny. No, it's freaking thing was acting stupid. The glitch had to happen right then, you know? Right then. But I should have a quick save right at the start of the mission. Right? It's not a bug, it's a feature. All right, let's get back in here. Yo, are there night folk in Red Dead Redemption 1? Yeah, you guys see how I was able to walk right up to him though? What what was that all about? The night folk the, the I was like a ghost or something to them. You got this, girl. Guys, I want to thank you for over 450 likes on the stream. That is awesome. Hey, what's the commotion? You a loon or something? This night folk country. This night, night folk. folk country. I can handle myself. <laughs> okay. Maybe you should clear out, though, if you're so <laughs> troubled by things in the night. It's night folk. And I would. It's just they on my property. Hey. W would you help me get them off? Well, I I'd pay you for your troubles. Partner, I'm over here. Pay me, huh? Maybe. Show me where this place is. We'll see. All right. Let's go. Should have went up and see if the ghost there. was there instead of starting you this mission, man, right? Partner. We'll grab some night folk would put me on the pipe. They got their paws on me. Hang me up. We're safe and stuck together. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I lost Hamish's hat. Everything about Hamish is gone now. Hamish's hat's gone. Buell's gone. Hamish only lives in our hearts now, guys. Yeah, this is Arthur's hat. He gave it to John. Oh, 
Oh, you thought the sombrero was gone? Now, now we got the Arthur hat back. I mean, we might be able to get the sombrero back if, if that's what you guys want. no bats. I'll tell you when you got to worry, all right. Look at that. He fresh. You see what I mean? This night folk work. I knew this fella. Good fella. Didn't deserve this. Now come on. tree been here for years. You think it's bad being a dead fella on a tree? It's worse when you're a live one with a stick through you. Lamps out. They might not speak, but they sure can see. Now, look out here. There's gators. What a place to make your home. It's nice, ain't it? I'll be here with my rat gun. Okay. Do what you can. Oh, they got someone. Mm, poor fella. Oh, too late for him. That's bad juju, all right. Hey! Clear off of there! Shit! They're coming! Speak! be more of them uh, stay here I'll see Oh, God damn evil. I 
It's gotta be them! Okay. They're dead. Well, well. Okay. I got something for you now. How you doing? Give me a moment. What? Here you go, partner. <sighs> what is this? Swamp trash? No, that's some of the good stuff right there. You good man, mister. Damn decent. You gonna be all right here? I'll be fine. Night folk won't come here anymore. They dumb, but they ain't stupid. <sighs> so long, then. Yeah, there it is. Dudes look legitimately like zombies. Yeah, this is where we're, we were trying to come to see the ghost, but we're gonna have to come back tomorrow, right? You gave me a gold tooth and a muskrat pelt. There's my girl. Alright, so we'll go camp and then we'll try to come over here. Um, Look out! Tomorrow night. Ghost hunting time, guys. Think it's gonna be foggy out? Good girl. Let's go. Met the devil in the cave. Only Arthur can interact with him. Come back to me. Come home.
I mean, it doesn't mean it was a ghost, guys. Just some lady fucking trolling me from the trees. So we just gotta keep coming back? Hello, girl. I mean, that was a that was a little uh, that was a little weird, you know. I never, yeah, I never got the miner hat. Ninety-four TL, thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate it. Foggy out tonight.
Not foggy enough? Well, it wasn't foggy the first time and she started fucking talking. Not foggy enough for her to fucking hide in the trees. to be foggy. Fucking foggy right here, dude. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting. So it seems like we just keep getting a couple, like, little chunks of dialogue. Okay. Oh, you can't approach the ghost? Just use your binoculars and look around? I didn't see anybody. She was on the mini map? Really? This is a pretty freaky, um... Uh, if you get close, she'll disappear. There. Let's go, girl. I've never played Red Dead Revolver, no. 
is that? Is that a gator? What's a rotting boar? Guys, thank you so much for almost 500 likes on the stream. I really do appreciate that. Fuck out now, guys. Did. She is, guys. She is. She sounded pretty angry at the end there. We found her. We found her. We definitely found her. You okay, girl? Let's go. So we found the night folk and we found the ghost. That's pretty legit. All right, guys. So we got Hamish. We did some of the cool animals. So we're going to end this stream here, guys. So I had an absolute blast um, with this game. I'm pretty sure there's a billion Easter eggs that I haven't even found. Like a bunch of just little things here and there. Um, I could literally probably spend hours and hours and hours on here just looking for all the little Easter eggs. But um, we will end this here. I got to say this is now my favorite game of all time. Red Dead Redemption 2. If you guys have not played it, it is top tier. One of the greatest, most immersive games I've ever played in my entire life. Uh, the story is great. The world is great. It feels so lived in. The map is so diverse. The hunting, the features, everything in this game. There's there's a lot of content in this game. I, like I said, I put about 140 hours into this since we started streaming. And, um, you know, there's still a bunch of challenges and just and it almost feels like an endless amount of things that you can go around and experience and find and see. It's absolutely insane. Um, but yeah. Uh, so from this point going forward, we are going to start Red Dead Redemption 1. All right. We're going to continue the story of John Marston going forward. Uh, but before we actually end this episode, I, I told you guys we are going to watch the credits that I missed. Um, so what would it be called? What John Marston credits or epilogue credits or just RDR2 credits? Okay. Um, uh, wow. The credits are pretty long, actually eight minutes. Okay, here we go. Um, all 
Getting married for real. Right here. Red, I need you in the world. Hello, thank you for the sub. I do appreciate it. When I see you behind the glass, I forget that I'm in the cage. They bring me to Sunday Mass, but it never up the rage. Red, I love you in the world. Yeah, I'm going to get demonetized. It is what it is. That's the reason why I skipped it originally. Um, but now it is what it is. Commonly by my side. Right here. Red, I love you in the world. Red, I need you in the world. Brandon, what's going on? Yeah, so the reason why I have it so because we get a lot of uh, troll and spam, uh, Brandon. So the uh, we could mute it, I guess. All right, here we go. I'm just trying to skip ahead to actually see the scenes. I don't care about the actual credits. Fafo, thank you so much. Hey, thank you for the su or the super chat. <laughs> Thanks for the playthrough. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Yeah, they really got married though. Abigail deserved it. You know what I mean? Like John and Abigail, they, they definitely deserved it. Oh shit, are the Pinkertons came and found Micah's body. And they just left his ass there too. Coward. <laughs> thank you so much for the super chat. No, thank you, Brian. It was hey, I had a blast. No, thank with you, this. Brian. Was fun. I appreciate that. Yeah, I know. Imagine the gang, you know, that would have been crazy. So Charles leaving. They still playing the demonetization music. Who is that? Is that? Oh, that's Mary Beth right in the book. Yeah, it, it's really stupid, guys. The whole copyright thing, like, um, that would that's what happened with me with um the game. What the hell was the game? The Quarry. Um, every bit of music in that game was all copyright. I got hit with, in one episode, and me and Cryptic too, because Cryptic messaged me, like, dude, did you get hit with the same? Thing? I got hit with uh, seven copyright, um, seven cop different copyrights. And yeah, that, that's, it's, it's fucking, it's so annoying. 
every single episode. Uh, we played Vice City, and uh, the music in Vice City actually got my my video blocked. <laughs> They took, they made me, they took the whole fucking video down. I had to mute like a bunch. Of, at that point, the video was so chopped up and muted that I just, I just was like, yeah, this is stupid. I think I ended up just taking it down. It's Valentine. So what are those uh, Pinkertons? Yeah, man. Uh, fair use only works for ten seconds. Uh, you can you can fair use music for ten seconds at a time. Um, anything over 10 seconds, it's no longer considered fair use and you can, you have to pay ad revenue to the, uh, I have to pay the people who make the music for using their music. Even though I didn't put the fucking music in the game. Like, why do I got to pay you to use your music in my video? Like, you know what I mean? It makes no sense. It's, it's stupid. So it seems like the Pinkerton agents are like going around. Are they? They found Micah. Now they're looking around Valentine. I wonder if they're looking for. I don't, I think this music here would be fine. But it's loud as shit. I mean, so let me turn it down a bit. They're still looking for the black water. Yeah, true. Yeah, still looking for the black water money. That's Rhodes, right? There's Pearson. Can't believe my man owns his own store. It's ballsy to hang that picture up right there, dude. Frank, the best game, dude. The best game. Agents seem like they're harassing a lot of people. Javier, you're insane, bro. There's nothing overrated about this. Like that, you can't even put overrated in this statement, in the same sentence as this game, bro. <laughs> He's like, I'm just playing, dude. <laughs> no, nah, I know, man. I know.
Yeah, we visited Pearson. Yeah, we, we met him in Rhodes. Oh, you still haven't played RDR1 yet, Frank? Oh, yeah, you definitely need to jump on that. I'm about to jump on it here. Shit, who knows? Who knows when we'll start it, guys? Who knows? We're not going to be able to get to the... Uh, it's almost 11. I won't be able to get to the uh, Black Flag stream tonight like I wanted to originally. Uh, but it's all good. I'll, I'll probably do it tomorrow. Raj, thank you so much. I really do appreciate the dono. Uh, this game lost to God of War for game of the year. What? Hold on. Sadie's leaving. She spent a little bit of time with us. She's off to live her best life in Tahiti. Um, God of War beat Red Dead Redemption 2 for game of the year. Now, don't get me wrong, guys. God of War was awesome. I mean, I, I we played that a few months back on the channel, and it was a great game. It, it really was, but it doesn't even fucking compare to this. How, this game didn't get game of the year? Like, you can't even put God of War in the same bracket as this game. It's not even... You, it's not even... That's stupid, man. I just lost all respect for Game Awards, man. That That's fucking... That makes no sense. Cleon saying RDR2 won. I know, um, I know I've seen Arthur Morgan's uh, voice actor. He won an award for something. Yeah, there's some messed up stuff in the game, but the thing is, is you can't judge a game by how players play it. You know what I mean? Like, like if, if people are going around doing fucked up shit in the game, like that's on the people, like not on the game developers. I mean, the game, the game is, oh, Mary. Like if I want to go around and be an absolute savage and kill everybody in the game that like, yeah, I'm a messed up person, but at the end of the day, it's it's a bunch of ones and zeros, man. It's a bunch of ones and zeros. Like if I go shoot a horse, I'm not really shooting a horse. It's fucking code. <laughs> you yeah, know, they'll put fucked up shit in movies and Oh, it's just video. It's just it's just a movie. It's just fake. You know what I mean? You know, it, it, it's so crazy how they how they they'll do that for movies. They're like, oh, it's just a movie. You know, there'll be all these movies with all this violence in it, all this crazy shit. Oh, it's just a movie. It's just actors. It's fake. It's just a video game, dude. It's fake. It's fucking fake. You know what I mean? Now I get. You know, people can implement their own will into a video game which is the difference between movies and games like I can't make an actor do something evil because of me you know what I mean uh, whereas a game I can control I can make the characters do what I want so it is a little bit different but at the end of the day it just is what it is <laughs> Bad was like, yo, I take offense to that. That horse is a horse. NPC lives matter. 
like like the poor guy shot um for for his horse. I do feel bad for that. God of War from Sony Sat won Game of the Year and Rockstar Games won four other awards. It still should have won fucking Game of the Year, though. It should have won Game of the Year and those four other awards. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, they found the farm, guys. They found the farm. Hold on. I was sitting there chit-chatting. Look, look, look. John's out here with his son, right? Boom. Them fucking agents found him. Javier, brother, thank you. So when are you going to play the Batman Arkham series? Ah, it's so funny you say that. Or the Telltale series. Um, and keep up the good work, man. Happy Father's Day. Javier, thank you so much, brother. I really do appreciate that. I'm going to be getting on it soon, man. Uh, well, then, I, I definitely will be. I'll probably play the Telltale ones before I do the Arkham series. But uh, I'm not sure, man. That's a that's a bag. I'm about to open a real big bag of worms uh, with a game series that I didn't expect to play. Um, but I'm going to give it a shot. See what you guys think. Um, I, I posted it today in Discord. So I know a lot. If you guys are in my Discord, some of you guys might have seen the game that I'm interested in playing here soon. But there's so many games I want to play, guys. We are playing Red Dead Redemption 1 next. Yeah, that is happening. Yep. We'll probably be starting that within the next few days. Two minutes. I've never played The Wolf Among Us. I, that's a Telltale game, too. I want to play all the Telltale. I played all the Telltale Walking Dead games on the channel, and they were so much fun. They were so much fun. I played Ghost of Tsushima on the channel, too, but that was a really long time ago. It was very low quality. Um, I didn't really get to experience the game all that much. I might do another playthrough of that, honestly. Yeah, I know, Bad Wolf. We just talked about uh, Shadow of the, the or what was it, Shadow of the Tomb Raider uh, the other day, and people were saying it was really, really good. And we started Metal Gear 5 on the channel, too. I have a couple episodes of that. I got three kids. Three of them bad boys. Yeah, we played Resident Evil 7 on the channel, too. Hey, was that it? They spotted John, and then... They, okay, now there's still more. Little clips coming. Maybe. Shadow of the Colossus. I've never even heard of that. There's Telltale Game of Thrones games? What was my favorite part of Red Dead Redemption 2? Um, shit. I would have to say, like, I really liked chapter, like, the first chapter. Um, just the, like, the love around the camp, like, that, I, I would say, like, the first chapter when you're in Valentine and all that, that chapter felt so good, and even when we got to the second camp, or right there outside the lake, uh, I really did enjoy that one, too, uh, it, that, that, I would say the first two chapters were, like, my favorite, hands down, and then, you know, once stuff started falling apart with the camp, and, you know, shit started getting bad, that's when it started to feel... Not bad, I, I, you know, I, I, the game is perfect, but that's like, it just started to hurt, started to sting. So they found John at his house. Um, I'll take it, that's going to lead into uh, Red Dead Redemption 1. So there's that. So guys, I appreciate you guys uh how many how many parts did we we went like 20 parts on this on this series um 
like a hundred and something hours, 140 hours we played. Um. I don't know. Only 123. I don't know why I thought it was 133 earlier. But no, 124 hours I put into this game. 124 hours. That's so good. That's so good. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys again. I really do appreciate all of you for hanging out and sticking with me with this series. Uh, we will be moving into Red Dead Redemption 1 from this point. And then after RDR 1, we will be playing Undead Nightmare. Uh, I also, I posted on uh, discord today. I'm considering, I'm not hundred percent sure yet guys, but I was thinking about trying mass effect, uh, on the channel, seeing how that does. I played mass effect way back in the day, but I bought, if you guys can see here, I bought the legendary edition and I guess the legendary edition is like a remaster for one and uh, for like all the games. And I guess they redid one, made it look better, made it control better. Um, so that is definitely one of the games that I'm I'm excited to try because like I said, I, I Mass Effect One was real rough to play back in the day. It was very, very clunky. Very, very clunky. Um, but to see a remaster would probably be pretty damn dope. But yeah, I ended up buying the Mass Effect Legendary Edition. I'm considering running a a, a series to see, you know, how you guys like it. Um and just kind of play through that because that that's a pretty big game, you know. A, a really, really good RPG. Probably one of the best open world space RPGs I've ever, ever even heard of. So, but we'll see. We'll see. If you guys are interested in uh, seeing Mass Effect on the channel, let me know in the comments also. And uh, yeah, we'll be, we'll be looking into that for sure. But uh, thank you all again. Like I said, we're not going to do, um, we're not going to do Black Flag tonight. I don't have enough time. It's already 11 and I don't want to cut that stream short. So uh, we'll just end up doing it probably tomorrow. But uh, thank you all again. If you haven't on your way out, smash that like button. Uh, let's me know that you guys uh, enjoy watching this and want to see more. If you're new to the channel, please consider uh, subscribing. And other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.